Hey, how's it going? Today I'll show you how to get Redbox TV application to your Fire Stick or Android TV. Redbox TV is an app that you can use to watch live TV or live sports online and totally for free. I just had to blur out my screen right here because YouTube doesn't allow me to show you the exact channels available in the app, but trust me, you are going to like it. So now, without any further ado, let me show you how to get Redbox TV to your device. First of all, you will have to get an app called Unloader. You can actually get it for free from the official Amazon App Store. To do so, just go to search on your device and here in the search bar, start typing Downloader. And now, as you can see, the Downloader has already popped out for us at the bottom, so there was even no need to enter whole name of the app. We click on Downloader and that's the app which you need to get to your device. However, after you get the loader, it's not over yet. We still have to set it up. So to set up the loader, we got to go to settings. Let's do it right now. Click on that button with the gear icon, then scroll down and go to My Fire TV. Open it. Here you have to enable developer options on your device. However, on some Fire Sticks and especially on the new ones, the developer options can be hidden by default. So if that's the case and you cannot find developer options anywhere, no need to worry, it's really easy to make them appear. Just go to About, select Fire TV Stick, and now you have to click on the middle button on your remote for 7 times and do it fast, so let's do it. As you can see, now at the bottom for me it says no need, you are already a developer. That's in my case. And in your case it's going to say that you have become a developer now. So if you go back a bit, you will finally see developer options, which just appeared right here. So we open them, make sure to enable ADB debugging, then go to install unknown apps. From here, locate the loader and turn that option on. So what it does, it's going to allow you to install other applications from the internet and not necessarily only those apps which are only available in the official Amazon App Store by default. And that's exactly what we're going to do right now. So now, finally, let's go to the list of apps on your device. There it is, open it. And here you'll find the loader, which is set up and ready to use on your device. But before actually using the loader, there's one more thing which I really recommend doing. It's of course connecting to a VPN. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN. Because they're super fast, we got a great app for Fire Sticks, Android TVs, phones, laptops, or pretty much any other device you may use and they are not expensive for such a premium service. In fact, they cost less than a cup of coffee per month, which is great pricing for us, the users. In the VPN app, you just connect to any server, let's say we'll connect to Denmark right now, and from the moment you connect, all your traffic is going to be totally encrypted. It means nobody can track you or snoop on you online. And that's really important if you want to stay out of trouble. And if you don't have a VPN yet, but you want to try it out, I do have a great offer for you. If you use my link, which will be in the pinned comment below the video or in the description of the video, you'll get 3 months of NordVPN totally for free, which is an amazing offer. And if you're watching this video on your TV or on your Fire Stick, then just grab your phone or your computer, open up a web browser and go to topvpnoffer.com. That's my website, which is going to give you the same amazing deal for NordVPN, with 3 months for free. Or just scan the QR code, which you can see on your screen right now, with a camera of your phone. It works the same way and it's also going to give you the same amazing deal. And now, finally, let's use Downloader safely. So we gotta open the Downloader application, here it is, open it. Wait until the app loads and after that, on the left side menu, it's really important that you click on Home and not on Browser. So once again, you have to click on Home. And here in the search bar, we got to be entering the code, which is going to be 17561. So once again, the code is 17561. And then we click on go. And while the website is loading, make sure to subscribe my channel so you could get even more content about Fire Sticks. And of course, hit the like button below this video if you find this video helpful. This will allow us to create even more content for you. And now when the website has loaded, we just have to scroll down a bit until you see that download for Android button. That's exactly the button we have to click on. So we click on it and wait until the download starts. Usually it doesn't take long, but of course it all depends on your connection speed. Then click on install and wait until Redbox TV gets installed to your Fire Stick. 
After that, don't click on Open yet, instead press on Done, because here we'll have an option to delete the installation file, as we don't really need it anymore on our device. So click on Delete, and then Delete once again. This way we get rid of unnecessary installation files from your device and save you some free space. Now finally, let's go to the list of apps on your Fire Stick. There it is, open it. Scroll down, and here at the bottom you'll find a Redbox TV application. Now I would recommend you to click on the Options button on your remote. That's the button of three horizontal lines. Click on it, and then press on Move to Front. This way, Redbox TV is always going to be at the very top of your application list, and therefore it's going to be really easy for you to access the app every time needed. Just don't forget to keep your VPN connected to stay safe and out of trouble. Enjoy and see you next time. Bye-bye.